Even this concept of being a steward, it has to flow out of a place of pure love for the Lord, joy in the Lord. And that only comes, you know, when you fellowship with Jesus. If you're in a marriage, you love your wife, you love your husband. Well, how did that relationship happen? It matured, it was fostered, it took time. Me and my wife, like when I first met her, I didn't know her. I was just infatuated with her because she was smoking hot and fun to be with and we just hung out and we were it was awesome she was great but where i'm at now 20 years later it's like i've seen like five different women in her i've seen her grow i've seen her mature i've seen her give birth to my my children i've watched her become a woman of god now it's not so much about looks it's not about the passion that fades yeah those things are great yeah she's still the most beautiful woman in my eyes all those things right like I'm still, you know, absolutely attracted to her. But the relationship is different. I now live my life in a way that my love for her, my serving her, doing all the things that I do for her, it doesn't flow out of a place of, well, she's my wife, so I better listen. Oh, she's my wife, so, you know, happy wife, happy life. You know, I hear these guys talk like this. It's just, it's garbage. That is, that's not it. My serving and loving and everything it flows out of a place of my love for her. And it's because of a 20 year relationship, investment, commitment, ups, downs, trials, affliction. We've been riding together for a long time. I've seen the good, the bad and the ugly. I've fallen so far short. She's stayed committed, covenant. You know, when the, if the ship goes down, man, I'm going down with the ship. The commitment, it's not a contract. Guys, America just preaches this message. Marriage is like the Verizon contract. Well, Verizon sucks. You know, the service is terrible. You know, the rates are going up. AT&T is over here offering a new iPhone. It's shiny. I'm gonna go rip up this contract. I'll pay the fee and I'm moving on. I'm gonna sign a new contract. That is not a godly marriage. Covenant. Again, till death do us part. But that, that was not how it was when I first met my wife. That was not how it was when we got married in 2008. That's not how it was when we had our first child in 2012. But I will tell you that every year I got to know her more and I got to grow in my love for her. And, and where I am now, almost 20 years later, I don't care what happens, I ain't leaving. Never leaving her side, ever. I will die before I leave her. This is to the death. And guys, it's no different. You know, marriage is a picture of our unity with Christ. Actually, the unity with Christ is where marriage comes from. All those things that I just said, it's the same thing as we walk with Jesus. And so you want the passion that I have? You want the zeal? You want to be obedient? You want to be one that wakes up and says, man, like, I don't want to do this. and I don't feel like doing this, but I, I'm going to do it because because I this is my Lord, because I love him so much that my feelings don't matter. I kill the flesh. I crucify my old life. Guys, it happens through this built relationship. Spending time.